Good day royalty Capricorn here and today people today we are back at Subnautica the sea we play through as the morning sun rises upon this beautiful new day um I just realized something is that supposed to be the island covered in that fog over there because you don't even you, you don't even see the island from over here so I'm guessing it's just covered in that thick fog why is that even a thing I guess it's, I mean I know why it's a thing but I'm like why you have to be an annoying thing so last episode we learned about what happened to the Degasi survivors they're all they're all living horrible lives at the moment and what we're going to do is we're going to make two things we're making a laser cutter and a stasis rifle this is what we will be doing this episode of a, a subnautica the seaweed pedro and in subnautica the seaweed playthrough we already have a few of the things that we wanted because we collected it ahead of time so let us see what we need for this stasis rifle just a computer chip and how do we make that table coral gold and copper wire and how do we make copper wire with just two coppers okay so table coral I know what that is, and it's this, because I, I scanned you before. Yes, table coral. Oh, I, didn't, I don't think I needed to break you, but you know what? I have some table coral, and now I need me copper, and then we should be all set. We can make ourselves a stasis rifle. We can make ourselves a stasis rifle right now not now we cannot make ourselves a stasis rifle we need a computer chip gold and copper am i correct yes yes i just got too ahead of myself i'm so sorry so let us take some more copper because we're going to need a whole lot more of this and we need gold uh i know i have gold somewhere here it's somewhere and I have me some gold right here so I'll take me two pieces and now I should make myself a computer chip and we should be fine so last 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 episode we learned that the sunbeam survivors are on their way soon so we will be getting rescued off this advanced wiring kit Oh no, I don't see that here. So the so the sunbeam people will be here for us shortly. But let us make ourselves a stasis rifle. Now we could blow out some brains. Who needs a knife when you have a rifle? Who wants to play with me now? You think you a thug? You think you thug, Gasapod? You think you thug? Hey, that's not a bad insult. Boom! Whoa, this thing explodes. Oh, it holds them still. Oh, it is called the stasis rifle. Of course, it's going to hold them still. Wow. He's completely immobilized. Whoa, this thing is dope. All right, we need... Next thing we need on our list of materials is a... Is cave sulfur. 
now i don't know if we have any more of that but i don't have a problem with just getting some i don't have a problem with that so let, let us get us some cave sulfur and get up out of here really quickly where is the caves where are you blow up fishy things come out take some of that copper to replace all of the shit i wasted oh here we go I still don't know what you guys look like and I don't know where you just came from but now we have ourselves some cave sulfur and now what else do we need I, I don't I don't remember paying attention too much to everything that we need yes I have oxygen already I died two times in this playthrough over some BS so if this was a hardcore playthrough, this would have been atrocious. It would have been infuriating. You know, I probably might come back and do a hardcore playthrough, but once I play through this game once, I don't think I'm going to play through it again. Um, what else do we need? A no, no. We need two diamonds. Now, I know I collected a fair amount of diamonds. I should have should have collected a fair amount of diamonds <clears throat> should have collected a fair amount of diamonds <clears throat> should have collected a fair amount of diamonds one I have one diamond what is one diamond going to do for me but you know what? It's a good thing that I know where to find it. It is a good thing I know where to find me some diamond. But I'm not going all the way near the island. No, I don't need to go all the way over there. That's too damn far of an adventure. I do know that if I leave the seaweed forest and go to the Red Sand Sea, I should be able to find myself Red Sand Sea. Hi Red Sand Sea. Do you have any opening clearing caves that I can go down? It will be very helpful and beneficial for me as, as it is. Do we have any caves here? No caves? Not at all? No caves? That's such atrociousness. Let, it, let us get ourselves a cave. Uh, this, this guy. Where is this guy? Um. Oh, over there. Okay. Are there multiple of the same biomes? Because that's what I'm always thinking every time I dip into this game. Like, are there multiple of the same biomes? Because... It's like every direction I go, there's always a seaweed forest. And every- I I'm, think I'm seeing- Oh! Fuck! It just rocked my whole shit. Because every time I- it always seems like there's multiple different biomes. Why do I feel like everything in the world is chasing me right now? All right, let us let us let us go back here to find this cave area of importance, and let us get ourselves a buddy. Yes, down here, because we know down here is where I can find me some diamonds, diamonds. But I can't go too deep. So let us leave. Let's see if I could find me some Oxygen diamonds down here. Right now, I'm looking for this thing here. The, the dark sail deposit, but that was gold. That wasn't... It wasn't diamonds. Uh, this is magnetite. I don't need any more of that. Uh, 
shale outcrops. Oh my gosh. This seems like it's going to be a bitch to find. Yes, another one. Please be diamond. Yes, we have diamond. Yes. So now we can leave. We don't have to come back here no more. We have the material we need. Bye. I'm out of here. We don't need to be down in this beautiful, luscious biome no longer. We can leave and we can make ourselves. I forgot exactly what we was making and that's actually horrible. That I have no clue what I was about to make. But you know what? On that note, I'm about to take a shot. Welcome to a cross-faded episode. Oh. Subnautica. Welcome to my descent into madness. As we get into the third part of our luscious... As we get into the third part of our luscious adventure down in the deep abyss of the world I should probably stop leaving my life pod like that I mean not my life pod my um thingamajigger like that because last time I died leaving it and I and I did not much appreciate that at all I just was minding my own business why well, you gotta kick up the mock speed and just be gone come here oh fuck I lost you Come, come, thank you. Now, I don't think I need that much for food, but I'm gonna just take another one just in case. Oh, and a fourth one? And now we should be good on food. <laughs> now we should be good on food. So we don't have to worry about death being among us. You know, once I started playing this game, now that I'm finally getting deeper into the story of this game, it's actually really interesting. It actually really is interesting. Yes, because I'm alive. I am alive. And now we must make ourselves a... A... Laser cutter. Now, we are fully equipped with many of tools to explore ourselves the aurora because i think that's the next place on our venture here we still have our boy float we still have our first fire extinguisher we have a bunch of water a bunch of shit we should not worry we should not run out of anything if to be frank so let us put all of this shit back because I don't really care where they go. As long as they are here, I don't really care where you go. Alright. I got all necessities. I got all necessities. Alright, let us, let us, let us go out and traverse the Aurora. Because the Aurora seems to be the next place to go the rendezvous coordinates that I have to pick up something from the data terminal data care package some shit we have to pick it up 